Hi, I'm going to be showing you how to uh, get Minecraft Worlds back from being corrupted. Now, this doesn't always work, but it's a strategy that you can use in case it does get corrupted. But before I go on with it, I must say, if you have a Minecraft World that you actually like, you should have a copy of it at all times, just so you don't... In case this doesn't work, you are still with a Minecraft World. So basically what you want to do... So if you have a Minecraft folder that like, got corrupted because your power went out, and you want to get it back, you want to go, this is on for PlayStation, you want to go over here to settings, then you want to go to storage, actually no I'm wrong, uh, you want to go to save application, save data management. Then it'll close the app. And you want to go to save data in system storage. Then what you want to do is upload to online storage. And when this loads up, you click on the game that you want being Minecraft. Now, you see you have all these saves. So, for example, right now, here's a kit PvP. This is my kit PvP. This is a save from September 11th, 2021. This is yesterday. This is the last time I was on it. So if that world may have corrupted today, you could go to this one, click on it, and upload to your online storage. And then you want to click yes. Now, this will take a minute. Now that you're done with that, if you load Minecraft back up, it should be there. What it does is it'll save the data in your system storage even if you didn't make a copy most of the time. Like I said, this doesn't 100% work every single time, but I got one of my corrupted worlds back using this method. And... You can just upload it back to your online storage and it should appear on your thing that you can go back onto it and you have it back. Like I said, don't be stupid, have a copy. Now that I'm back on Minecraft, if I click play. I have this kit right here from 9-11-21. This is my kit PvP. And yeah, that's how you do it. 